to all your family, family, toy, baby, and diarrhea. Unleash the Elf on the Shelf Elf Pet St. Bernard! Yeah. A St. Bernard tradition. Yeah. Family, family, toys. So if you've seen some of our other videos, you know we have quite the elf collection. We have our elves. We have our elf pets, reindeer, snowy, and, and, now, and now we have a dog, a St. Bernard. Look, so let's look. And look how cute he looks right there with the elf and Santa. Look, look. Okay, let's see, Ethan, let's see the box, the back. It says, adopt an elf pet St. Bernard to keep Christmas magical at the North Pole. There's More Christmas, yeah, there's a book. More Christmas spirit is needed to save the North Pole. So Santa is sending uh. St. Bernard pups to kids who believe. Help Santa. This heartwarming tale encourages children to engage in acts uh, of kindness. What? Mama, I did the toy while we already got. Yeah, you see the reindeer that we already have? Yeah. On the bottom down here, exactly. Mm -hmm. All right, so let's look back. This heartwarming tale encourages children to engage in acts of kindness to generate more Christmas cheer, which Santa will need in order to ensure Yuletide missions will always succeed. This Christmas spirit is then captured in each puppy's barrel until it's released each Christmas Eve. Look at the barrel. Oh, the barrel has a little heart like Snowy had on, on her necklace. Ooh. Adopt a St. Bernard. Read the book as a family. Give your St. Bernard pup a name. Register your elf pet St. Bernard at elfontheshelf.com slash St. Bernard to get an official North Pole adoption certificate. The children are needed. They must do their part to work alongside you with joy in their heart. That, that's Santa Claus. That's why I was talking like that. <laughs> <laughs> and you can download the apps, the Elf on the we're Elf Pets apps today. That one. Yeah, we had this one before, and now we're looking at this one. It's available on the App Store and Google Play. So down here it says, the Elf on the Shelf Elf Pets are special North Pole animals you can adopt and love. Sent straight from the North Pole, each Elf Pet comes with a special storybook and an official adoption certificate. Adopt an Elf Pet's reindeer and help Santa sleigh fly on Christmas Eve. That's Snowy that we have from before. All right, enough of this box. Let's see the side, oh, yeah, anything special. Okay, here it says, Elf Pet St. Bernard Tradition and the Elf on the Shelf logo. And look at the Bernard down there, Saint Bernard. Oh, he looks vicious. No, he does not. Nah, he reminds me of look, what it's a book. Beethoven. Remember that show? <laughs> <laughs> that movie. That's pretty. Some old. of you kids were too young for that. Open side flap to view book. All right, what do they mean by this? this oh, look, you can touch the dog. Do you see that? You can touch Ooh, that fluffy. Before. Ethan, you want to touch him? Go. Go ahead. Let's see you touch him. Touch, touch, touch. Uh oh, he looks vicious. <laughs> Sounds vicious. Oh! oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Don't attack! Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Santa's gonna be like, what you do? Look. Oh, look when you open. Ooh. No, no, no. Look. Very fancy. Look at that, there's like a whole bunch of dogs over here. It says, these pups have assembled. <gasps> to rescue the soul of the holiday season and save the North Pole. Oh, it says that right over here, doesn't mm -hmm. it? Mm-hmm. Very fancy. But, but I think it might be like snowy when it was really hard to open. Oh, goodness gracious, let's hope not. Oh, All right, let me grab the book. Yeah, have you seen our video with snowy? It was real tricky figuring out how to open that oh, book. Oh, look, the book came out easy. Yes. All right, Elf Pets, the St. Bernard Tradition by Chanda A. Bell. Mm-hmm. All right, let's see. What have we got here? <gasps> Blue pages. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> oh, right. nothing! Elf pets, the St. Bernard tradition. St. Bernard tradition. Hey, that's sliding. Millions of snowflakes. Ah, our, our elf on the shelf is named Snowflakes. Flutter in place, each crafted by water and lighter than lace. They shelter a secret and fill up the sky as elves swirl and twirl on the air as they fly. Beyond the gray veil of this thick winter snow, the Christmas star shines with a warm, gentle glow. And as is the custom, when clouds finally clear, Santa's village grows silent and all gather near. Oh, look. Some polar bears. And the owls. owls. This reminds me of like Harry Potter. 
Isn't that? Mm -hmm. According to legend, when the star first appears, the elves stop and measure the world's Christmas cheer. This Christmas spirit of faith, hope, and love shines down in bright beams on them all from above. Mm -hmm. This moment's importance cannot be denied, for without Christmas spirit, the sleigh doesn't glide. The scout elves can't fly, and the toys don't get made, and the Christmas Eve flight could be delayed. That's not good. Mm -hmm. So every year the North Pole awaits the state of the world's Christmas spirit update. When Santa steps forward, it's time to begin. The findings are finished, then given to him. That's like an elf army. Did you see that? Oh yeah, there's a lot of elves. Look at that, Ethan. Hmm? And what's that? A polar bear. A polar bear. Oh look, and there's snowy. And there's another one. Snowy, yeah. snowy. And another one over there. The dog is snowy. Okay, so it looks like they're measuring Christmas cheer. Checking it out, and then, oops, here we go. Let's see what it says. It says, the spirit of Christmas is deep at the soul of what makes us magical at the North Pole. We have to be certain there's no more concern, and the star shines brighter each year it returns. Ruff comes a sound from the edge of the mass. The crowd slowly parts. A great dog walks past. Could it be Barry, the old St. Bernard, the watchdog of, Chris the watchdog of Christmas, who served as its guard. Everyone whispers and clamors to spy this great fabled dog as he walks by. Some say he's as old as Christmas itself, a friend of St. Nick and the eldest Scout Elves. Wow. So apparently he's old. Oh, there's some more. There's an army of dogs back there. Look at that. Look at the dogs. Okay, and they're here to rescue the soul of the holiday spirit. And it says the children are needed to do their part. I read the whole story, right? And see, the children need to show love and they need to do good things. Washing dishes, reading, donating. This was like Snowy's app. It tells you about doing good things to help. And then it makes his little barrel light up. And when they get enough of that spirit, it helps Christmas. Let's see. It says, wait, how, how does the cheer get back to the start year after year? Santa and Barry reach out of their arms. Together they offer a tiny heart charm. With a one, two, three up, it's tossed in midair. It pops like confetti in cold Arctic air. It breaks into pieces, ringing like chimes, and places a charm on each barrel it finds. So these charms on the barrels will give the spirit and you adopt it and you give it a name and you get to huggle, huggle, cuddle and snuggle these. It's not like the elves that you can't touch them. And, and then, and it's like snowy. Yeah, just like them, see? And they're friends with the elves. And then when they give that magic to the star, it helps Christmas every year. And then at the end you can put, we welcome their elf pet St. Bernard on blank, blank. You know, 2016, we chose the name. <gasps> Here's the big tricky part. We promise to do good and carry out acts of kindness to help build Christmas cheer. We've been trying to decide on a name. Here's the author, Chanda Abel. We've been trying to decide on a name for our dog. What names have we come up what with up, so far, What do Ethan? we want to name him, Ethan? What do you want to name him? No, what is it, Chloe? Coco Ruff Ruff! Coco Ruff Ruff! That is one option. One, one option. option. Papa really many, likes many Nick Furry. Elves assemble. Nick Furry. <laughs> <laughs> that rolls off the tongue, I think. Papa I think that that's a perfect Ruff gingerbread. Name. Eve, Killer Claws, St. Nick, Killer Claws? Killer Claws was Papa's idea. Awesome yeah. name. So we're thinking about Coco Ruff Ruff, Gingerbread, Eve, Killer Claws from um, Papa's uh, suggestion list there, St. Nick Eater, what? St. Nick Eater? <laughs> That's a pretty that. good name. <laughs> Darkness, <laughs> Jose, Noel, he looks, he looks like a Jose. Cinnamon, Jingle, Kringle, Mistletoe, Tinsel, Gift, Angel, Star, Flaky, Twinkle, Peppermint, Pepper Eggnog, and of course, Nick Furry at the end there. Nick Furry. In the lead right now is Coco Ruff Ruff. <laughs> three votes from us. Well, Chloe, Ethan, and I. Well, I think that and that's going to take it. No. And, and Buzz. Yeah. <laughs> and Nick Furry from 
Papa. And oh. also Grandma. Oh, Grandma, Grandma picked Coco Rough too. Rough too. How do we get him out of here oh, so we can gracious. see what name this we get? This is where him. we had the problems last time. We should rewatch our video. Oh, look, look, it says to open cut sticker and lift clear cover. Oh, if we only follow directions. Let's see. Now it's easy. Now it's easy. To Let's poop. hope. Oh, goodness. I want to poop on every dog. <sighs> what? No, we won't say that. Awkward. I just did I just No phony, guys. Yeah, Santa's not gonna care for that. All right, so we lift this. It said we had to lift this. Oh yeah, that's All right, so here's Coco Ruff Ruff, Lugo Good. Coco Ruff Ruff. Coco uh, Nick, Ruff. Nick no. Furry. <laughs> <laughs> he does not like that you name. see, he's missing an eye. <laughs> right no, goodness gracious. That's so true. <laughs> so here is his barrel. Nice barrel. And Chloe was noticing, look what's on the side of the barrel. Elf on the shelf. Let me see the other side. And then on the side it says Elf Pets. Wow, wow, it's different on both sides. Cute, cute, cute. And then there it says Elf on the shelf, on Elf the Pets. Butt? A Saint Bernard tradition. On the butt. Butt shot. Oh, butt shot. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no. Double the shot. So look how cute he's very furry. <laughs> Fluffy. And you can touch the pets, right? Yes, these you need to hug and love and show lots of affection. That's how they I want to that do barrel. one of those things. Then I do a daddy now. You, you want, want see, yes. When you get the app, it tells you you have to, you know, do nice things, donate. Do now. Hold on, help people. What do you want to do, Ethan? You want to touch him, hug him? What do you want to do? Boys, no. Ah. no take him away. Oh, Ethan just grabbed him and hugged him. He wanted to show love already. So. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> that dog is fast. <laughs> so, very cute. Let's see, compare him to Snowy. Can I have Snowy over here? I'm very too. Size wise. Huh? They're similar ish in size. But. Hey. Big say up, oh, butt shot again. <laughs> so Saint Bernard and do nose. Elf pets reindeer. And do nose. And do nose. The nose. Yeah, but look, the heart see on the snowy, huge heart. Yeah. Smaller heart on our Saint Bernard on Coco Ruff Ruff, Can right? Do Does that do mean he needs less love? Like no, but he's got a big barrel to hold it, I guess. Oh. Oh. Like it works. Oh things. goodness, he wants to grab them and hug them again, doesn't he? Is that what you want? <laughs> Hold on, let's finish with that. So cute, adorable little set here. Okay, so which is Wait. your favorite? We only have one room, enough room for one pet. <gasps> love for all, love for all, love for all. Hugs going here. So that's our Elf on the Shelf family. It's expanding. Bigger every year. With our newest member. What should we call him? Coco Ruff Ruff or Nick Furry. Nick Furry. The Elves assemble. <laughs> what? <laughs> Papa wants Nick Furry. I Tell us which one you think is better in the comments I below. I've got a little dog. You've got a little dog and we need to name him. So tell, us what, tell us what you think in the comments I below. Dog. Okay, yes, we got a dog. Your dog. Tell us what you think in the comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't. Pop the magic dragon. What? Okay, it's getting crazy. We gotta go. Bye.